Hey yo, how's it going everyone? Entropy here today with another video. Today, we have the new DICE event. Now, this one is different from the previous one, so I really wanted to give a shot. Um, I have spent a little time with it, just to be a little bit more familiar without starting a video about it. But uh, overall, I have some initial thoughts. I want to go through how it works and um, showcase, you know, maybe some initial strategies going into it. Um, so, let me just briefly introduce the events um, over here. This is the new type of seasonal dice event. It's called the Full Powered Sure Win. Burning Hearts are together. Um, there are quite a few differences, so you are still going to go through the board collecting cards. And by collecting cards, you will see stories and unlock other stuff like boss fights and all that. And um, of course, you're going to get drops, which you can then exchange for skins, for packs, etc, etc. Uh, but what's new is that there are rankings. So just like the new clan events, there are rankings similar to the tower event. Um, so there is a competitive aspect to it right now, where you will be getting more rewards, like exclusive banners, um, skip tickets, etc. Some other things we changed is the, uh, the, uh, the, the, the actual spots. So before it used to be either cards or um, drops, right? And uh, of course the main ideal spot would be the one with the character fight right at the end of the board where if you do beat it, you get a guaranteed well three times or five times multiplier on the uh, future drops on the next round. Now this time around, it's actually quite different. This time around, we have these uh, these new spaces, box spaces, which where when you land, if the event is not completed yet, there's a chance to get one card um, as well as guaranteed currency. So you will see the, the lowest rarity, the bronze um, bronze chest gives you 50% for a card and 30 dumplings, uh, while the um, the rainbow one, the, uh, the triple rare one, I guess, um, with 100, you will get a 100% chance for a card. So definitely kind of feels nerfed because you do need to pick up more cards than you used to, including the GU zone, right? So, you know, it's 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 what, 48 cards instead of 40, and um, you don't even have a guaranteed chance to get a single card, where before a min roll would be one card, a high roll would be three. So that is quite a little different. Well, it's quite big to me, but whatever. Um, next up, we have fight spaces. So you can see your characters here. In this event, you have Shion, Tokoha, and Kamui, where if you do beat it, you will get 300 dumplings. Um, and so you can use skip tickets here, so you don't have to fight it. Like before, you had to fight it before you can actually skip fight. But now you can just straight up use your skip tickets. And um, I do like this change because, well, you know, AI fights, everyone can beat them anyways. Um, it just, it's a, just got kind of a waste of time. And um, it gives more value to the idea of skip tickets, which they are giving abundantly in events. So if you have the time, if you like to be frugal, save them for team events or other clan events, maybe save them. But for me, I, I have like a hundred something, you know, you get a lot every day. So I, I'm fine spending them during the clan events. You get five every day. So yeah, just spend them in my case. I don't really care too much about it. And you can always exchange it in the event uh, in the shop. Next we have dice spaces. So this is a new one where if you land it, you get a random die. So you could um, you could pick more dice up. Oh, dice is plural, die is singular. Um, this is the, 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 the checkered space uh, where this is the where you start when you pass it. Um, if you did land on it, um, you still get the fever chance. So if you remember before, yes, if you did beat the character fight, you're guaranteed to spin the roulette. If you skipped over it, you don't, right? But if you land exactly on this spot, you will still get a chance to roll, even though, you know, there are some missed spaces next to the three times and five times multiplier. So now, as you can see, there are some different, you know, items that you'll get, like two times drops, dumpling drops, um, guaranteed whatever, guaranteed card, something like that. So it is something, it is a slot that I haven't exactly reached yet, um, but it is something that you should work with. And lastly, we have a question mark special space. So when you land on the space, you get a special random effect out of the three. First one is you get three random dice. Second one is you get three special dice with the Trinity Dragons. And uh, the Bangaro bonus, which you can also win here, is uh, get a chance to win a ton of dumplings through a tap game. So there is a mini game in a game, um, not just Vanguard Zero. So that's quite fun. 
Um, of course, rewards for the competitive aspect of it. Here we go. Um, you get, you know, of course, by just going through the event, you get the banner, the sleeves, and uh, stuff like that. And uh, you can um, exchange for the skins. So my room, I guess, Chrono, and the skins for Tokaha, Shion, and, and Chrono, based on these uh, Chinese characters. And of course, home stream, very cute sleeves, um, and my room kind of content. Love that panda. And packs, of course. Where's the competitive ranking here? This is where the competitive backpack plays. So I am at 1,210 points. This is the number of dumplings, I guess. And I'm below 5,000. First place is at 150,000. That's. What the? Whatever. Baffled. Um, first place, you get, you get something like this. Very nice, very nice. Um, skip tickets, of course. So they're gonna get, give these out abundantly. No packs, though, which is a shame. Um, I think this is just for your room, which is really whatever, but eh, no, I'm not, not too sure about that one. But yeah, what, what's, um, 100th is at 9,660, so that's still like almost 8 times, 9 times of my score. So I definitely need to put in some work if I do want to rank high. But yeah, chests, um, dice, space, character fight, space, question mark, special space, and the flag, I guess. And the exchange we talked about. Um, what else? Of course, the daily missions, it's gonna end soon, which is why I did well, some um, every day it resets. You know, if you log in in these times, you get one special dice, the uh, one, two, and three. So you still get one of each every day, but you can hold on to them. So you don't have to spend it on that day. Um, by going through your VP, you will get more dice as well. And here it says, um, if you reach, if you get 400 dumplings, you get two more dice. If you get uh, 600 dumplings, you get one more dice. So. They are incentivizing you to just go through the event, um, and I definitely do need to work on it because it does end in 37 minutes. Uh, so yeah, that's 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 how it works. Um, so let's try to go through this. How many special dice do I have left? Um, I do have a three guaranteed. Of course, you can buy into them for 100 gems, which is really expensive. Um, I don't suggest you do it unless you really care for the skins, because skins are also pay to win now. So um, yeah, uh, since this is the question mark space, we haven't seen this before. Let's actually do a guaranteed 3 roll to, uh, to get onto it. So, no more. When you beat the character fight, you don't get the guaranteed roulette anymore. Uh, so, we did win three special dice for that, but it is three ones. I don't know how I feel about that, but let's hope we roll into a four. Let's see what we do. Four! That's a two. Alright, golden. We get the 60 drop, but what, what are the odds of getting a, um, getting a card with the golden one? 70%? Well, we whiffed. We low roll. That's like a 30 chance. 30% chance of missing. Um, if we spend two ones, we can actually get to the checker. So let's do that for the sake of content. I still think the checker is pretty good because you get a reward out of it, right? So, so the bronze chest, common one, doesn't mean much, but it's okay. It's okay. Um, and here we go, guaranteed into the checker flag. And we get a card. Ooh, what do we get? All right, there's a chance for fever time, the Bangoro. Two times or three times, no longer three times, five times. Nerfed again. And of course the, um, oh, the guaranteed cards. Okay. All right, let's roll. All right, here we go. Tap. Ooh, Vagro guaranteed. All right, fever time. Okay, don't know what happened, but uh, let's just keep rolling. All right, one time. 30 dumplings. Oh, Vangoro guaranteed. Oh, here, Vangoro. Um, now we do have one guaranteed one, but um, hmm. yeah, the guaranteed dice is, uh, is is valuable. Perhaps I should be saving in, in case I don't roll into it. Let's see. Oh, okay, we get to the character fight, so I can showcase the character fight. That's perfect. Um, uh, and here we go. So you can fight it. You can skip to get it. Uh, reward for beating is 300 dumplings, and the rule is just 5 damage. So it's the same as the one we have in global right now, if you're playing it as well. Uh, I'm just gonna skip to get it. Yes, it says you will spend it. I am okay with it. And we will get our dumplings after it loads. There we go. There we go. And we're at. Alright, we need a 4 roll. Okay, 3 or 4. 3 or 4. 3 or 4. 1. Alright. Um, so that is, that is, that is how it is. I guess I can't showcase the Bangoro. I guess I can. But, um, the, the, the diamond chest, eh, the diamond chest is really whatever. Uh, it just guarantees you the drops and the, um, and the, the cards. So that's basically it. 
for today, unfortunately. It's a short video. I mean, it's already 10 minutes. But um, lastly, I guess let's check out the um, the shop and uh, go through everything again. Uh, you have the My Room. You have the skins. Skins Chrono looks pretty dank. Shion looks alright. And Toka has the little wife little, waifu's life room. Pretty cool. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Um, sleeves. Oh, the panda. Love that panda. Tokoha. And um, you, you still have some old stuff because they added statues now. So that's cool. So if you want them in your your uh, room. And the panda must get absolutely game changing. And yeah, that's basically it for uh, for the event. You have a lot of ways to get skip tickets uh, here as well. Where is here? Where is here? Here as well. So uh, yeah, skip tickets easy to come by. I don't mind spending them. But um, generally speaking, I guess the strategy would be to use your guaranteed dice, um, try to land on the on, on this this drop, and try to get on the special dice, get more dice, um, work around it. Because the more dice you get, the more chances you are to get more dumplings, which means more dice you get, which means more drops. Um, and that's that's basically the approach to the, to the events. Um, of course, if you want to be competitive and you want to win, um, there is only so many free dice you can get. So expect to spend some 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 uh, currency. You can see, you know, even after hitting multiple bonuses, we're only at like we, we only got like six, 500 points. I don't know how much they spent to um to get to 100 100k. But yeah, I guess um that's just how it is. You know, events these days it's um nerfed again. I guess is my initial impression. Maybe by the end of the event, I would feel better about it. Uh, but we do have a couple, like a, a week or more for the event still. Um, so, you know, it's it's a work in progress. And um, let me know down below how you feel about the new event. Are you playing it? You know, which skin are you going to get if you, if you do get through it? Um, I do think with three skins and nerf drops, it is going to be hard to get all three. So I will need to consider carefully which one I'm getting. Personally, I feel like getting the Chrono one just because I am a Hero Chronicle main in this game. But uh, secondly, probably Tokoha because, you know, Tokoha Snip here. Um, but yeah, that's basically it. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you, Nova Grappler, Kanwi, for supporting this channel and being a member. And thank you for liking the video if you liked it, subscribing if you haven't already and want to see more. And can't wait to, um, to, to get more content out there. Alright, stay safe and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye.